are working on a book that we're going to publish. Um, and we are, people are airdropping stuff so we can put it in our book. And they, so far we've got real, really good work mm -hmm. from people. We have a really nice cover for that book too. So mm -hmm. what we're doing basically on this iPad is looking at people's work and we decide if it's good enough to go in the book and if not we just and leave it there. And if it's not like copyrighted or they got that out of um so or or Google. Yeah. 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 If we if they do that then we will get sued. Mm -hmm. We're doing this for education. <laughs> this is the one this is the group. Yeah that, that's what she did. It was a different no, show Allie. <gasps> show her <gasps> Allie's opinion. That could have been really cool. I like how she did that, the little thing. Yeah. 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 Putting in our name so so they'll know that we are the authors of this book. <laughs> so check it out the book is called a fourth grade guide to volcanoes it should be on the itunes store tomorrow check it out and support it <laughs> awesome. y'all are crazy <laughs> All right, so it is carnival season down in New Orleans, Louisiana. You can back the camera up a little bit, make sure you get all of this. And I've ordered a king cake delivered here to the school. It was made fresh in New Orleans yesterday and shipped next day air. If you want to know what a New Orleans king cake is, if you don't know if you're not from New Orleans, if you're not from Louisiana, from that area, do your research, because I don't have time. What we're about to do is we're about to cut this cake and dig into it. Just a reminder, there is a baby inside of this cake. Do not bite on it until you push down. If you get the baby, then you have to bring the next king cake to the next party, which will be tomorrow. So what I like about having Legos in the classroom is we get to build a lot of stuff 
For example, we get to build cities, we get to build theaters, we get to build restaurants. And you, some people might think that's not educational, but somehow it is because we, we can learn about, for example, we can learn about some monuments like the White House and stuff like that. And we're learning about how cities um, grow and stuff like that. And I also like that we have Legos because we can all imagine and do whatever we want to with them. And we don't have to ask anybody what we can do because it's our imagination. Some people might think you can't do anything educational with Legos, but you can build the, the solar system with them. And a teacher could use that and teach their class about um, the solar system. Like, for example, if you were trying to do a history lesson, you could use Legos to do history because you could build those scenes with Legos and tell your kids about that and tell the classroom about the uh, scene of the Legos. I think Legos are good um, things to use in the classroom because you can do build different things in them. Like we were studying about volcanoes and we could build a volcano with Legos or we could build other things with Legos that we're learning about.